Here you go. I'm ready to go. <laughs> that was a little close. <laughs> what? That was a little close. What's wrong? I'm a little nervous. Why? Because I'm leaving my children. Alright, get in the car. Yeah, I'm gonna get in the car. <laughs> That's the wrong dog. Where's my dog? Come on, trip. Say goodbye. Up. Yep, go. Cool. I know. I'm not used to this one, eh? Do you have something to lay here for his paws? What? Something to lay on my leather for his paws? We're going camping, buddy. Sorry. I'll see you later, okay? Come here. <laughs> what are you doing? Come on, Cash. Good boy. <laughs> see? 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 Pause on my level. What happened? Oh. It's been forever since Will and I were able to get away together. Just her and I. So we're gonna go two nights camping. Where are we headed to, Will? Killarney. Yeah, we're gonna go to Killarney for two nights. We got the old big boat on the top. Haven't used it yet. Uh, got Tripper with us. So, we're kid free for two days. Woo! Dog's face is covering yours completely. <laughs> we can hold the camera higher too, right? <laughs> What up? <laughs> no, it's true. It's true. Well, we're just driving down the road to Clary right now. Don't know what we're gonna do. We might have to uh, get a um, a car camping spot tonight and then head out tomorrow morning. We might be able to paddle in a little bit and get a, a spot tonight. It's all, it's just after four. Um, and tomorrow we're gonna hike up the Silver Peak Trail which is like an all day thing to the top of the mountain with the doggo, so that should be fun. Hopefully there's some, still some colors. As you can see, there's tons of colors driving in here. So we will uh, see where we get to camp tonight soon. Oh. How am I good at anything? It's just what happened. Go ahead. Say that again. Is it, is it on? Say, how am I good at anything? How am I good at anything? <laughs> <laughs> I don't, I don't know if I'm... Yeah, you're good. Stop doing that. <laughs> yeah, you're fine. You're, you're phenomenal. What? You're phenomenal. I'm phenomenal. And he's not good at anything. <laughs> Speak up. So, so far today, <laughs> we have driven to the Killarney, what, what is it? Canoe? Clarny Canoes on Bell Clarny Lake. Clarny Canoes on Bell Lake, and where we were supposed to get our permits, and it was closed. Mm -hmm. It said it was open till 8, but we were there at like 4.15, and it was not. <laughs> so now we drove for a bunch of nonsense, and then we drove <laughs> all the way to George Lake, which was also closed. And then we had to go into town because we had no gas left. We had to get gas. <laughs> <laughs> and wood and water because uh -huh. you need those supplies. <laughs> we got all those things. We did get all those things. $14 for a bag of wood. <laughs> and now we are driving back to George Lake to get a camp spot. Where we will camp without paying because there's no one there. <laughs> no one there to pay, so we kind of have no choice. We're kind of stuck or we just kind of camp on the side of the road. <laughs> Yes. Anyways, tomorrow we have a small drive, maybe about an hour drive back to um, the original put-in spot, and a couple hour paddle, and then we can hike, <laughs> do the, the, the mountain hike we've been waiting to do. I have been very excited to do. Yes. <laughs> No, no.
look like the <laughs> like <laughs> the emperor from like uh, Star Wars. Star Wars. Yeah. Hmm. With your, with your hood on. <laughs> so what are we doing? We're sitting in the cold. <laughs> it's <having not> that <laughs> cold. Look at that fire, bro. <laughs> My wine is keeping me warm. Nice. <laughs> Platypus full of wine. So yeah, we're just car camping tonight. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> just car camping tonight. We'll uh start our actual trip tomorrow. The big hike will be fun. It'll be good. Burn a lot of energy uh, for the old doggo. Will's never been here before, so in Killarney they're known for their white quartzite hills and their mountains, so so, did I say so yet? Yep, a little bit. We'll see some white and hopefully some red leaves and yellow leaves still. And the smell. The smell of the fall. And a big hike too. We got a big, we got a, um, I got a normal sized backpack on we'll have for the day. Have some lunch. It'll take like a good five, six hours by the, by the end of it. So, it'll be a, it'll be a good hike. So, so, so. 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 Well. There you go. I'm ready to go. It's kind of. Start pumping some blood so I warm up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Tripper, out of the water. Come, out of the water, man. What are you doing, silly? You're gonna be all cold now. Boat. In the boat. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Stay. Alright, get in, honey. You got your paddle? Yeah. Oh, this is different. This is different. <laughs> no, no, Tripper, stay. Stay. Can you switch sides, bro? Well, Tripper's doing great in this canoe. Normally, he's too, he's too big for my pack boats now. Like, uh, whenever I have him in there, he's, he, he can't even move around. He can't stand up or anything. So, I do have to get a bigger solo boat for him. I definitely can't solo this boat. Um, yeah, we'll see what happens next year. And maybe a prospector from Swift set up in a pack boat fashion. But he's starting to shiver too. We have to get to a portage and let him run a bit. Shouldn't have walked in that water, buddy. Shouldn't have went right into that water waist deep. The whole point of this trip is to get up to the Silver Peak, so that's what we're doing. We're gonna be cutting it close. We're doing it no matter what. We're doing it no matter what, even if we're uh, hiking back down in the dark. We got steaks to cook tonight. We need some firewood and stuff, but. I'm not going to be able to get firewood before we start this hike. Nope, do it all in the dark, she says. She has faith. That's what Killarney's known for, that white quartzite rock. There's some big old mountains around here. I Hopefully, early November, I'm going to do the Lacloche backpacking trail with Tripper. Me and Tripper do about 80 kilometers in three nights. It's a legit loop, and you'll see... Tons more of that white quartzite. That's got to be Silver Peak in front of us there. And I believe our campsite's just in front of Will. You see a sign? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Tripper. Okay, let's get over there. We made it. We made it. Look at this gear bomb site. <laughs> so we have to uh, get the gear that we need for the day inside my Fall Raven bag and, and head down the lake a little bit more and start our, our hike for the day. So we need things like food, extra clothes, food for the dog, water, stuff like that. Well, 
kid, just dump it all out, honey. We're going to get the tarp up quick, too, I think. Okay. So we'll bring the rain gear. We'll bring some sit pads for the top. Do you want our extra sock? Uh, nope. Possible's pouch. Tripper's collars. Uh, tripper's leash. What? Why don't you put some baby bell on it? Yes, please. Baby bell the heck out of it. You want one wrap or two? One. Got everything all packed up, ready to go. This backpack turned out to not be overly light after all, but it'll be all right. Um, got everything we need. All the rest of our stuff is packed away to stay dry in case it rains, but I don't think it will. We don't have much of a paddle left. I'm going to leave the big camera here. We'll take the little GoPro style camera just for the, the weight sa savings. But yeah. All right. Next time you see us, we are hiking that trail. Alright, well, <laughs> what did you want to tell the people? Well, <laughs> the guy, when we got our permit, had this really fancy idea that there was a trail that we could start on that would take us to this trail. We could not find that trail. <laughs> <laughs> we were lost in bushwhacking to find the right trail. You done? That's it? That's it. Okay. What else do I say? I don't know. If we did not have a GPS? We would be back in the boat. Yes. Yes. <laughs> so he told me to hop, hop over a little pond to uh, to access uh, a trail closer to the Silver Peak Trail to cut off a big portion of it because we didn't have enough time for the for the allotted time in the day. And um, yeah, it turns out that that was all just nonsense. I could have we didn't have the portage at all. We could have stayed on the same lake we were on and. Uh, just got over but anyways we're, think, here we're here now thank goodness for the gps we're on the trail we're trying to make up some time so i can kind of quick but, but the trail is flooded out in a lot of spots but it's a, it's a nice crisp cold day so we can definitely make up some time this is an all-day thing it's noon we're starting it i imagine we don't get done until about six Colorful. It's so pretty. I just so pretty. I'm not complaining it's cold anymore. What? I said I'm not complaining it's cold anymore. <laughs> you warmed up? I've warmed up. So guys, we're climbing the peak now. <laughs> <laughs>
Go. Go. We made it. We're here. Pretty awesome view. Lots of colors. Freaking gorgeous. I think a lot of that. Oh no, a lot of that brown is oak. Yeah, a lot of that brown looks to be burned. Yeah. Or dead. Dead, I mean. All of that yellow out there is all birch. And then a bunch of evergreens, and then you get into oaks. The oaks grow on the rock. Oaks and pines grow on the rock. The evergreens, the spruces and stuff will grow all low. Oh, that's cool. Do you have a I do. Is that a flock of cranes? That would be crazy. Maybe. That one farm by us, there's like always like 30, 40 of them sitting there. Got to be. I've never seen so many cranes together at once. Look at the little Anuk shuck. Oh. It sure is. Oh, look at this is really pretty. Yeah, you can see the mountains. Yeah. yeah. You can see the contours. All over there too, a lot. Fun fact, the La Cloche Mountains used to be bigger than the Rocky Mountains. It says so on the map. That's smart. <laughs> from water. It's not from someone sitting? No. Nope. Oh, it doesn't have a good pair. Oh my god. Yeah, I bet you up there you get the reels. It's so pretty. Camp up here in the wintertime. Be mighty uh, windy and cold. That'd be quite a walk up. Yeah, with all your gear. Snow. Well, was it worth it? It was worth it. Yeah. The bushwhacking, the <laughs> wrong turns, the. <laughs> no, it's just a normal trip for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm glad we were able to finally get out here. A really nice place to take out when she's big enough to do it. Look at this crazy plant life up here. If I had a YouTube channel, it'd be all the things that I find cute in the forest. Yeah? <laughs> like what? Like those little tree things when we were bushwhacking that I was like in love with. 
the little Pennsylvania pines. Yes, I was in love with them. <laughs> so that's what my YouTube channel would be. Uh -huh, just the showing cute things, them? The cute things I find while I'm walking. And what, just showing them? Just showing them. And be like, these are cute. <laughs> these are cute, look I'm it. walking. Look it. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we should probably start heading back, honey. Alright. That's pretty cool. Hang out here for a little while. Got a decent hike back down, but it won't take us long. We're going down. So, I think where we're camped is just right over there. That's what Will told me, so we're going with that. My direction is better. No, uh, that's not been the case this trip. Only on the road. <laughs> We're back from our hike. We're back at camp where we were supposed to camp for the night. So it was a great day, great hike. On the way down, I kind of fell. <laughs> I slipped a little bit and my back is feeling pretty sore. So we're going to pack up and head home. We don't have a far paddle to get out. We'll be home in a few hours. so We'll do that. We'll get supper on the way out. I still feel very accomplished. We cut the camp last night. We did the hike, which we wanted to do. Actually, we did it really good. I think we did the whole trail back and there and back in what, four hours? Four hours, four hours with our little bushwhacking adventure yeah. in the beginning, which took an hour. Well, and on the way back, too. <coughs> yeah, so we're not too bad. No, uh, that we, trail said it took two hours. We did it in 45 minutes to climb. Yeah. The, um,. We stayed at the top for as long as we wanted to. It's not like yeah. we rushed, like we were, we were done. No, it was nice. It was really nice. It was beautiful up there. So anyways, good time away. But, now we'll head home. Actually, maybe we can, you want to go to, we can probably just get a hotel. And you take, you take a hot bath in a hotel room and stuff. Yeah. You want to do that? Yeah, sounds good. All right. Might as well take advantage of our babysitter. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, I know it's a short one. We have been a long time since Will and I did a video together. I think the last one, last camp trip was camping with a girl. And it did actually pretty well for, for its time. <laughs> How long ago was that? That was years. I was at uh, Hoist Lakes. Yeah. Years ago. Yeah. Emerald was like three. Tripper's tripping. But uh, anyway, yeah, it was a good time. Good time away together. And I'm sure we'll have some some more memories soaking in the bath. Oh, I can't probably can't see. That. <laughs> <laughs> the trip's not over anyway. <laughs> but thanks for coming along. And uh, yeah, there'll be more. I got some more super bushcrafty type stuff coming quick. So I'm sure you guys will get your bushcrafty fill. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Bye. I hurt my back. <laughs>